Yeah, I know, you're in one. <laughs> when I was around, they didn't have these things. In fact, it was a guy who got into Princeton who came up with the idea, huh, I'm gonna call it the Princeton Review. And he basically analyzed the test and say, these are the tips that get you through. Is there any calculus on this test? No idea? Any trigonometry? What happens to most people who are going to college? What are they studying in junior year? What are you, what are you studying? Pre-calculus. Pre Christ, you think there's any pre-calc on this test? No. A lot of the stuff in here is stuff that you were fresh when you were in ninth and 10th grades. So now that at least a year has been supplanted. You haven't practiced this stuff in at least a year. The geometry, the algebra one, the, the rules for multiplication. Please, that's all I have to say. Did you learn this as well? Yeah, I did, but I forgot this. Okay, all right, see? They're quizzing you on please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. And you, well, he's working on pre-calc. He just came out of school. I've been out of school for a while. Right. So, I mean, you, whoa, you're going to need some review, right? Okay. Now, you want to know what to review. And so that basically is part of the tip number 47 is telling you, remember what's on the test. And remember that what you're studying now is interfering with your thought process. Tell me about something you're learning in algebra, pre-calculus. Pre <laughs> you're failing, okay. But what, what's your mind saying as far as, um, you know, we, we have an adult inside us and we have a child. What is your child feeling every time you reach for that pre-calculus book? I don't want to do this, right? So now, what's the child say when he sees math on an SAT test? I don't want to do it. Well, and he's got to go back to taking care of that child because you want to have both the adult and the child on your side. The child provides the enthusiasm. The adult provides the map. <laughs> I want to go on the trip. Now, where, where is Disney World anyway? <laughs> I want to go to Disney World. I want to, you know, win this test. And you need a map. You need the adult in you to guide the child's enthusiasm. Say, I know you want to go and ride, but it's, you know, 8 o'clock. It's not time for the park to open yet. Right? <laughs> Remember what's on the test. Current classes might interfere with your thinking. Okay? I mean, in a variety of ways. When you took geometry, do you remember how you found um, answers? Anybody remember? Uh, What's that? Ask the kid next to me. Oh, you had the kid. Oh, that's a good way. Ask the kid next to me. Oh, this is turning into a better video than I.